Bala yan. Ilang bala? The police is investigating the killing of Cavite's Provincial Health Officer, Dr. George Repique. The Trece Martires Police is still looking for a motive. But Deputy Police Chief J.P. de Guzman says it's obviously premeditated. It could be related to Repique's work or personal life. Allegedly, meron daw. Two years ago, parang nag-umpisa na yung threat. To be a provincial health officer is malaking position. Maraming taong kaharapin, kausapin, o nakakasalamuha. Repique and his driver, Riorito Bacasa, were on their way home past 9 in the evening on July 11. When gunmen riding in tandem shot at the back seat of the car five times, Repique was sitting at the back. In the CCTV footage obtained by CNN Philippines, the motorcycle was spotted escaping the crime scene. Bystanders rush Repique and Bacasa to the General Emilio Aguinaldo Memorial Hospital. Repique died during treatment from multiple gunshot wounds. He was 47. Bacasa was wounded on the thigh. Bystanders who refused to speak on camera say the motorcycle used by the gunmen had no plate. Concerned group Health Alliance for Democracy says Repique is the third doctor shot dead in the country in just five months. The group is urging the health department to do more to protect health workers in the countryside. Hindi naman kailangan niya ng bodyguard, dapat sila eh. Pero dapat naglalabas ang DOH ng uh, policy. Nang saan, kumbaga, pag may, po ako yung doctor at the front lines and I'm facing, and I'm facing such problems, I'm being harassed, and I am receiving death threats. Who do I turn to? Where do I go? Walang ganon. Walang ganon nakaseta. The local crime laboratory is studying bullets recovered from the crime scene and looking at five persons of interest who may be able to give vital information on the case. Rex Remitio, CNN, Philippines.